Anaí Aguilar has a gift for art. Like the great ones in her craft, art comes second nature for Aguilar. The Ibarra Elementary student put her talent on the line participating in the Rio Grande Valley Birding Festival Art Contest. Aguilar had been told on many occasions how good her work is. She had never competed in any form of art contest. But when the fifth grader found out she was the first place winner in her division, it was there Aguilar realized her skill is the real deal. i never been first place before because I've never been in a contest. So I started entering this one and I got I didn't ever, I thought I was not going to be in first place. I thought I was going to be in sixth or third. So until they told me that I was in first place, I got very excited. I started crying. And I was proud of myself what I have done for my school and me. Aguilar received the great news from Cynthia Duran, Ibarra Elementary's art teacher. Duran has taught art for over a decade and has come across many talented students. At the same time, you have pupils like Aguilar, who is a natural. She's a free drawer, very talented free drawer, and uh, she finished her drawing within days. Then she had to decide what medium she was going to use, and she's like, I've never done stippling before. Other students have been working on stippling, and she was like, you know what, it's, some, it's something you can try. And she was very successful. Uh, she did uh, spend weeks here with me during um, her lunch and electives and sometimes before and after school or during art club time. Aguilar created a stippling drawing of a peregrine falcon feeding her babies. A stippling illustration is a creation using forms of shading or dots. As she was progressing in her work, Aguilar realized her drawing needed more than just the birds and the flesh, so she added a nest and trees in the background. This was Aguilar's first crack at stippling, and she nailed every dot to the core. She basically just used a Sharpie, and she created that um, gradation with um, her artwork, and it was very successful. I'm very proud of her. The purpose of the contest was to promote awareness, appreciating, and understanding wild birds, which migrate to the lower Rio Grande Valley every year. Aguilar named her picture a good meal. I like the way she just incorporates her own concepts and um, it was limited to the images that she wanted to do. And she's like, Ms. Duran, I wanna do a habitat where they're feeding the young. Well, she had to do the research. She had to do her own um, inputs as well. Aguilar went up against approximately 250 students from all over the valley. She picked up her first place ribbon and trophy at a special awards ceremony held at Harnage Municipal Auditorium. It was a moment she'll cherish for the rest of her life. I was surprised because what I have done, like first place for, for the whole fifth grade dictionary, um, other schools too, that, that um, made me surprised because I didn't know I was going to be in first place. Her top prize has validated more than just a trophy and ribbon. Aguilar now truly believes her gift will take her to big places. Now more than ever, Aguilar is serious about pursuing a career utilizing her God-given talents. I was telling my art teacher that I wanted to be an artist and from to my family to us keep saying it that I want to be an artist. And I was planning what I wanted to do for my for when I grow up and finish my my schools. I was like thinking that I want to be an art teacher. Because of how talented I am. For K West TV, I'm Mike Gonzalez.